today on Eagle Nation News, the mid-morning show gives us a sneak peek of this week's new comedy show. Brenna Gibbons will be here in studio to talk about a new online trend. And up next, Caleb Delaney will discuss the massive event that unfolded in front of the school today. Eagle Nation News starts right now. Good afternoon, Prosper High School. Today is Tuesday, March 26th. I'm Haley Brown. And I'm Caleb Delaney. Now, Caleb, this is our first time actually anchoring together on desk. Yes, it's true, and I'm very excited. Me too. Well, with that, let's get into top stories. Operation Varsity Blues is now known as the nation's largest college cheating scandal in history. Famous parents such as Lori Laughlin from Full House and her YouTube famous daughter, Olivia Jade, are grouped with 48 others that got their kids into college illegally. Laughlin paid $500,000 for her daughters to get accepted into USC, and the first wave of defendants appeared in federal court yesterday. As prom comes up, many teens decide to drink illegally and irresponsibly. To combat this and talk about the consequences, this year Prosper made a new Shattered Dreams. This time, they decided to make the consequences more real, showing a performance of how the first respondents and people act in that dangerous time, while freshmen and sophomores watched part two of the Shattered Dreams video. Please be safe during parties and prom because those are very real circumstances that could happen to you. You've probably seen them around the school or patrolling the halls. The mid-morning show put a twist on our school's watchdog program. Take a look. We got a code red, code red runner. All right, Sergeant Bobo, hit me. So we caught the perp leaving school, hidden uh, Chick-fil-A, I believe. Asked him to pull up the old Skyward. Uh-uh, man was sweating like a sinner in church. <sighs> Case closed. Hold on, though. I gotta tell you, this guy's a tough nut to crack. He's experienced. <sighs> well, if the Academy ever trained us for anything, it's crazy like this, huh? Yeah. Hey, hounds for life? Hey, where the bad dogs go? Round. Right, let's go. Well, well, well. Look what the dogs brought in. Why am I being held here without my lawyer? Well, buddy, I uh, can't help but notice you were trying to leave school during a passing period. Rookie mistake, eh? Would you like to explain yourself, sir? Do you truly think I'm going to speak on behalf of my actions without my representative present? <sighs> well, looks like I see, eh? Sergeant Bobo, a moment. <sighs> this isn't working. Mm -mm. Good cop, bad cop? Yep, let's right. go. <sighs> hey. You know, I know your life's changing in a big way. Get up! <laughs> Decisions have to be made every day to figure out what kind of man you want to be. So I'm just letting you know. This isn't From working! One... Hey, get off! I'm sorry. Yeah, I need some uh, reinforcements stat. Hey, Denise. Hey, Denise. Thanks. Thanks, Denise. No cat napping on the job. Huh? See what I did there? All right. What do you think, tough guy? You're better than me? You want to tussle? Let's go tussle outside. <laughs> Come on. Hey, hey, where's my 
student. He's supposed to be presenting today. Sorry, guys. Let's go. Well, that backfired drastically. After this, Brenna Gibbons talks about a new challenge based on the state of Florida. Ammonia, nicotine, rat poison, and black tar heroin are just some of the 4,000 toxic ingredients found in cigarettes. Today, almost 2,500 children will try their first cigarettes, exposing their developing adolescent brain causing underlying effects such as sagging skin, skin cancer, hair loss, colored teeth, and many more. A single cigarette can ruin a kid's future and primes them for a higher likelihood of addiction to other drugs like cocaine. Just say no. Now we send it over to Brennan Gibbons with your Eagle Update. With new online trends and challenges every day, it is no shock that one from back in 2003 has reached the spotlight once again. The Florida Man trend consists of people going online and looking up Florida Man and then following it with their birthday. This social media refers to men in Florida who find themselves getting caught for doing ridiculous things. For example, if I were to look up Florida Man with the date March 21st, a link would pop up with the title, Florida Man Shoved Woman Because He Wanted to Eat Egg Rolls in Her House. And that's just one of the many different scenarios out there. This trend has led to many new memes on Instagram, Twitter, and even Facebook. I personally tried it and got many laughs out of it, and I wish I could tell you what mine was, but it wasn't the most school appropriate. I do recommend you go online and see what all you can find. Well, that's all the time I have for you today. Be sure to follow us on Twitter at Eagle Nation News, and check out our website, eaglenation.net, to watch previous episodes. Back to you guys at the desk. Thank you, Brenna. Now let's take a look at the meeting schedule for the week. Well, that's all the time we have for today. For Eagle Nation News, I'm Caleb Delaney. I'm Brenna Gibbons. And I'm Haley Brown. Live long and prosper.